So here we were, miles up the Tiente River, looking for what we did not know. Max. You listening? Max! So like I was saying, I think they're a group called the Krashapret. Why'd you tell me they were called the CS? They are. I mean, Fabiana. She was kidnapped by the CS. The guys that crashed our little party at the stadium, they were a group of paramilitaries. You'll have to forgive me for not being able to follow all this. You're not supposed to follow it. The government can't even follow it. It ensures that no one's ever guilty. So why'd they do it? Bust us at the stadium. Yeah, somebody told them we were gonna be there with a whole lot of money. Anyway, the money's gone. We just hope we can get the girl back. Yeah, me too. Wonder where the hell she is. You know there's a harbor about a half a mile up? She's gotta be there. This is a known Comando Sombra area. You know, if I'd been doing my job properly, we wouldn't be out here in the middle of nowhere looking for some broad who got pinched on my watch. And that's what we tell ourselves, huh? It's all our fault. No, I'm serious. By the time they grabbed the girls, I was half cut. I ain't slipping, man. I'm slipped. I'm a bad joke. Max, we work private security. We're all ex-soldiers, ex-special forces, ex-cops, ex-good guys. We all have our reasons why we became ex. Maybe now we can put things right, okay? So that was it, was it? Say the magic word and be absolved of your sins. If only shit were that simple, I'd have done it years ago. Me, I'd been stuck in the past so long, I'd forgotten what year it was. Hey, Max, quit your daydreaming. This is it. It's over there. I'm gonna cut the engine. Glide in. Don't go anywhere. Here I was, some hopped up gringo a long way from home, making trouble the only way I knew. As the weather worsened, I caught a glimpse of the rusted shells of previous lives that had been lived out here in this swampy shithole, and I wondered if I would end up the same way, or what would happen to that girl I was supposed to protect. idea what lay ahead, and as much as part of me would rather be anywhere else, I knew this was where I had to be. I felt responsible. I just had to fix the situation right here. Take your sip for part of Já te falei pra tu parar de reclamar, fazer teu trabalho, mano. I couldn't understand them, but I didn't have to. Cheap hoods are the same from here to Timbuktu. The slab of meat on the boat was clearly the boss. Serrano, they called him. And it seemed that our suspicions were correct. Fabiano was here, somewhere further ahead. I had to find her quickly and quietly if possible. Last thing I wanted was a party with these clowns. Ah! 
So far, I'd managed to keep a low profile, a bit out of character for a guy who's only comfortable with a bottle of whiskey or a gun in his hand. I kept moving toward the signs of life, rubbing them out as I went along. I'd seen enough to know that Fabiana was at least alive, if not exactly well. Her captors didn't look like they were quite the kind and gentle type. I had to find that room quickly. I didn't want to think about what would be happening on that video feed now. Just my own imminent cameo. I'd seen was somewhere up ahead. My blood was boiling. I didn't have time to wallow in guilt and misery. Just shoot and move. If only I could have taken something for the humidity. find Fabiana sooner than later, if at all.
That was the chair that she had been held in. I had just missed them. She was on the move. If they'd finally decided to kill her, I wasn't doing anything to persuade them otherwise. There she was, right in front of me. The drunk fool in me wanted to make a play. But I had just about enough sense to know that I'd end up with another dead girl in my arms if I did. Não, velho, não. O irmão já falou, velho, ele quer ela inteira. Aí, você vai jogar dinheiro no lixo, hein? Caralho, cara, tá virando uma furada. It seemed Serrano's boys had targeted the entire Bronco family and didn't give a shit which one they pinched.
Serrano had taken Fabiana through the garage door. I had to find a way to open it. circle of this low-rent hell.
seen Fabiana in a worrying amount of time, but at least I wasn't following a trail of her fingers. Keep on going across the docks. I prefer to mix these with alcohol, but on this special occasion I'd make an exception. There they were. I had the feeling I'd been running one step behind ever since I got to this country. And maybe a few years before that as well.
Where's they, Fabiana? They took her in a boat. That way. Straight ahead. Okay, okay, don't worry. Hang on. Boy, did I need to hang on. The whole operation was slipping out of our grip. I was an overconfident jump and going into the jungle alone. Shit, more company! No oh, shoes up, man. My gun's beat up, broken, alive. I don't know what to say. Hang in there, baby. You can do it. Behind us, Passos. I see it! Look out! Another one down. Oha! Oh, That's them, ain't it? Fabiana's boat is in the front! Don't lose it! Get ah! 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 That boat is blocking us from the one we need! I can't get a shot on Fabiana's! We ain't gonna be able to take much more of this! Either day! Come on! We can't take much more damage, Max! Not cool! Decoy ball! Oh shit! Grenade! Grenade! Down! That doesn't look so good. We got into trouble! We'll fix it quick there, Captain. We need to move. Hey, you see that? 
slipped through my fingers for a second time. Another habit I didn't want or need. It was close. We almost had her. Damn. I don't think we ever had much of a chance. No one told us they had an entire goddamn army. I don't think anybody knew. Crazy shit. Yeah. It's all crazy, pal. Non-stop insanity. Thought I left all this shit behind. Easy gig, you said. What a fool I was to get involved in this madness.
Get up, bro. Max, wake up, Max. Come on, get up, you big bastard. Come on. I'm up. Yeah? You don't look up. Just give me a second, will you? Really not feeling too good. <clears throat> hey, Max, what is it with you in interior design? Huh? You, you really know how to give a place a great lived-in feel, huh? This is beautiful. Fuck off with the fucking wisecracks. Really, I'm not in the mood. Okay, sorry, bro. The boss wants to see us, so let's go, come on. Take your time, man. Fucking unbelievable. Jesus. I heard that. <laughs> 